Hello! Um, it is December 26th and I just woke up like a little bit ago so my hair is probably looking a little crazy. Just ignore it. It's fine. But today I wanted to do a little what I got for Christmas video because all the cool YouTubers do them and I wanted to show you guys what I got too. Just a little disclaimer, I'm not trying to brag or flex with any of this. Most of this is from my friends, and my friends are the sweetest people in the whole wide world. So, yeah, just putting that out there. This is a Secret Santa gift. I got this coloring book, and then some of my favorite coconut chips. I'm really excited about that. Then I got this book from one of my friends, and he wrote a little note explaining why he liked the book so much, which is really cute. He also got me these like mini canvases. How cute are these? One of my friends spoiled me. And she got me this tea sampler, which if you know, with the lemon tea situation, I love tea. She got me this like body wash. I think this, you can find this at Target, I'm pretty sure. Um, it's the Argan Oil and Lavender Relaxing Brain Body Wash. And I'm really excited about this. It looks super luxurious. I hate that word. Why did I say that? She got me this necklace and it has like a little thing right here and then a blue stone, and the meaning of the stone is calm. And then she got me this super cute little wallet. Um, I believe that you can also find this at Target, so if you like it, I got you. We have secret orchestra pals in orchestra, and my person got me a big bag of Almond Joys, which, if you don't know, that's my favorite candy. One of my yearbook friends got me some erasable pens because I'm copy editor, and I always make mistakes when I'm editing. <laughs> On Saturday, I did a gift exchange with um, my three best friends, Sylvia, Izzy, and Emily, who you know and love. Sylvia got me this giant thing of felt tip pens, and then she also wrote me um, a list of book recommendations because she loves reading more than anyone else I know, and so she knows all the good books. My friend Izzy, oh my goodness. She spoiled us. So first, she got us these little bags, and mine says feeling pretty. We all had different ones. She got Burt's Bees Flavor Crystal Orange thing. Um, some mini coconut bath bombs are so cute. And um, some eucalyptus essential oil, which I love the scent of eucalyptus, so. She also got me this book, which is called Everyday Gratitude, and um, there's just a bunch of these little, like, quotes and then at the bottom of each page there's a question which just helps you think about um, all the things in your life and what you can be grateful for. My friend Emily got me this necklace. It's a silver bar necklace and it says with not for on it and that's probably like weird for some of you like what the heck is that? So with not for is basically like doing things with God instead of for him. So it's like a daily reminder for me so that I like always have Jesus as a partner in life. And that was a super special gift and I like almost cried when I opened it. So thank you, Emily, if you're watching this, you're the best. So my friends are the sweetest ever. Oh, I love them. We are going to move on to what I got yesterday from my family. I'm going to start with the stocking. So I got the shower loofah. Then I got <laughs> some throat coat and it's actually lemon tea. So now I have more lemon tea. I got these cookies from Ikea. They're like chocolate, like shortbread cookies with chocolate. Can't wait to eat those. Then I got this little brain tease. <laughs> and you basically have to try to get this metal ring off the tree. And I was trying yesterday and I just couldn't figure it out. Then I got some gum. Oh, I love gum. So we have some five gum, we have some winter mint, we have two packages of winter mint and then a peppermint. Then the next thing I got, which I was actually very surprised about, I got a $15 iTunes gift card. And then I also got this Chick-fil-A gift card thing. I got chapstick, Burt's Bees, haha. <laughs> and this is my favorite chapstick, the classic Burt's Bees. The last thing, last, last thing that I got in my stocking were all these like chocolate coins and like Reese's and Snickers. Now we're gonna move on to the actual Christmas presents. And I'm really excited about some of these. Like, oh, they're so cute. Okay, so this is a mask set and it even has a little like 
applicator tool, which is really exciting. Then I got me and my brother, this was like our shared present kind of. We each got one of these watercolor pads and then a set of real watercolor paints. And then we also got these like, hold on, let me pop this out. Um, little wheels for watercolors. So this is really exciting. Me and my brother usually paint with acrylics, so watercolor is gonna be kind of new for us and we have to like figure out how to do, <laughs> how to make it work. Next, um, this is from my mom. She, the, I was not expecting this at all, but it's this journal. Look how pretty this is. Oh my goodness. I have a journal I'm writing right now about like all the things going down in high school. So this will be my college one. And it's really pretty and I'm really excited to start writing in it next fall. The next three things are presents that I bought myself and I wrapped them and put them under the tree and um, I kind of wish I was kidding but I'm not. So the first thing is this Maybelline mascara set with a bunch of samplers. The next thing, I got a coupon from Bath & Body Works saying I got free product, not really sure what I did to earn that. But I got this, um, it's this body wash aromatherapy sleep black chamomile and then the last thing I got for myself was this candle it's a balsam fur and it smells like a Christmas tree the last and final gift I got this screen protector <laughs> and the screen protector was in a little package with a few other boxes and I was really confused because it said an iPhone it fits an iPhone 7 plus and I was like fam I don't have an iPhone 7 plus I don't even have an iPhone because at that point, I still had an iPod and I wasn't allowed to have a phone and my parents just kept pushing off like saying no, maybe later after you're driving for a year, after you turn 17, like then you can get a phone and it's been several months, several years of me asking like can I buy myself a phone and they kept saying no. <laughs> but so I was really confused when I opened this and then the next thing was this case for an iPhone 7 Plus. And then the third box in this little package is this and there's no phone in here right now actually it's empty well there's a charger in it because I'm filming on it right now <laughs> but my parents got me a freaking iPhone 7 plus and I was shook it like to the core you're kidding is this mine yes it had your name on it no you're kidding Christmas. Are you kidding me? No, this is not real. I'm so confused. What? I'm so confused. Like, I've never been more shook in my whole life when I opened this package. Because for my whole life, it was, Hannah, you have to buy it yourself, you have to pay for everything yourself, and not until we say so. And I was getting real frustrated with my parents. I was so surprised, you guys. Like for some people, getting a new phone for Christmas is like not a big deal. Like it's a big deal, but not as big of a deal as it was for me. But this was a big deal. So I don't know what else to say, but I got an iPhone 7 Plus for Christmas in jet black. I'm so thankful and still shook and it like doesn't even feel like my phone. I'm really excited about that and really thankful and um, to my parents if you're watching this. I'm really grateful and um, thank you so much. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. That is what I got for Christmas 2018. This is probably the last exciting what I got for Christmas because next year I'll be in college and probably asking for shampoo and like Kleenex because I will be poor. Yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Click the little thumbs up button and subscribe because the vlogs are gonna be a little more high quality now that I have this new phone. You're all the best. Go spend time with your friends and family. This probably won't go up until a couple days after Christmas, so everyone's probably gone home by then. It's fine. Eat some good food. Tell someone you love them. Okay, I need to end this video. Bye! Gorgeous.